Hi, it's Pamela. In this tutorial, we're going to go over how to use free templates found in Doodly. Hey, and welcome to the official Doodly YouTube channel. If you enjoy our content, please click the like and subscribe button below. Now let's get straight to the video. You'll see I'm in my projects tab right now, but there's another tab called templates. Let's go ahead and click that. And these are all free. They come pre-installed in Doodly and you can use them however you'd like. They're complete. They have a script that's built in with subtitles that you can edit and change to suit your needs. You can turn the subtitles on and off if you'd like afterwards. And then all of the characters and text can be customized to better suit your own particular needs. So you'll see we have several categories. So let's take a peek at one of them. To preview, you simply hover your mouse over the video that you're interested in and you click the preview button. And let's click play. I'm gonna turn the music down a little so I can talk. You'll see that it has text, it has graphics, it has these subtitles, and it has the music track. It does not, of course, have a voiceover track because it's generic at this point. After you go in and make your own changes, then you can add your own voiceover. And this is a minute and 38 seconds long, so we're not gonna watch the whole thing but I would like to go ahead and use this to show you how you can customize it. So let's go ahead and exit out of there. To use the template, all you have to do is click on it and give it a title. So what is this? This is a business forecast for the new year. Okay, so let's say business forecast 2021. Click create. And now your template is inside your doodly workspace and you can customize it however you'd like. So let's just take a peek at it. We've got multiple scenes here. Let's see, we'll just scroll through. Okay, and then we have this music track. Let's go to our first scene and start editing it. Simply double click on the text to change it and we're gonna call it 2021. Okay, so that one's done. So let's go to the next one. Company name goes here. So let's go ahead and change the company name to Acme Inc. Goals for year would be 2021. Now it looks like we have a layer here. What does that say? Next year. Okay, so next year, we're assuming you're making this because it was a holiday template for the new year. So we're assuming you were maybe making this in, you know, November or December for the following year. Right now we're in 2021. We're doing it for 2021. So, you know, do whatever makes sense. Now, since I have this bullseye on top, it's kind of hard to click on it and work with it. There's a corner there you could do, or you can click it directly in this panel, but I can't see what I'm doing. So what I'd like to do is I'm going to move this little bullseye over for a moment. And then I'm just going to come in here and type in 2021. And now I'll move my bullseye back. Okay, we'll go on to our next scene. All right, goal and goal topic. Okay, so let's click on this and put our first goal. We want to increase sales. And then what are the steps to do that? Okay, so we're going to go uh, hire more staff, develop incentives, and you see you're going to have to do a little bit of fine tuning. And then what's our third goal going to be to increase sales? promotions, let's say monthly promotions. Okay, so I don't really like the way 
that's landing on the page. I don't want to really have to shrink it, so maybe I'm going to just rearrange them to fit the way I like. Now let's say you don't like this font. Well, if you go over to the Fonts tab, you can change it. Just drag and drop the font on top and click Yes, Replace. And that looks pretty good. Now we've got a couple scenes customized here. Let's go back to the first one real quick and take a look and see if there's any subtitles on it. Scene settings. Yes. So there's a large subtitle. This is what the voiceover is going to be saying. So we also need to update it. So as we close out year, well, that's not going to be year. It's going to be 2020. We can't help but it get excited for the new year, right? So 2021, so I'm just gonna type right over. We accomplished a lot this past year, but have even loftier goals for the new year. With that in mind, we wanted to share a few of them with you. Now that's pretty generic, but I think that's a fine intro, so I'm gonna leave it. And then we'll go into our second scene and we're gonna do the same thing. Again, let's change the font. Let's make it this one, replace it, and let's make it larger. So scene settings. Okay, so this one is identical to the other one. And I think that, I know why. It's because we wanna have the same text. We want the voiceover to kind of start here and continue here. So what I would recommend doing is you could either do the same thing once again, which is easy enough to do in this case. So I'm just gonna go ahead and do it. Oops, 20, 20, and then 2021 and leave that that's fine you could also have copied and pasted from the first scene if you wanted if there's a lot of changes so let's do the same for our third scene scene settings and here we go this is where we're gonna have to make this match our custom stuff so we intend to increase sales we will do this by and then you're gonna do your voiceover text. And then we can go on to our next scene. So what is the benefit of this? So maybe it's gonna be a more sustainable. Why does it matter? You kind of get the idea here, right? So. Obviously this is too large for my space. So once again, I am going to adjust it. And I probably want to add those other points that I just wrote in the text. So more sustainable business. That looks pretty good. Now they're not in the proper order here. So more sustainable business is first increase shareholders so see how that's down at the bottom so we need to rearrange it so that these come on in the proper order i want to turn this music down because i notice it's a little loud so i'm going to turn it way down 15 percent okay i often find it helpful to record the voiceover scene by scene so that's what we'll do in this tutorial you go down to the voiceover track here and click the plus sign. And now we have our microphone. When I hit that, I'm gonna get a countdown and then I begin talking. So, here we go. As we close out 2020, we can't help but get excited for 2021. We accomplished a lot this past year, but have even loftier goals for the new year. With that in mind, we wanted to share a few of them with you. Our first goal is really important to us. We intend to increase sales. We'll do this by holding monthly promotions, developing an incentive program, and hiring staff. Okay, and then I just hit the stop sign, or the stop button, and I now have my voiceover for these first two scenes. I'm happy with the timing. I see I can make some adjustments, but we don't need to go over that in this tutorial today. And finally, those subtitles, they don't have to be on your video if you don't want them. So here's how you turn them off. 
you go over to settings and right here subtitles on or off if you turn them off that affects the entire video there's no more subtitles and that's the basics of using doodly's free templates thanks for watching